Alright, this was a team that I wanted to try out a while ago, I just never got to it, but it's basically the combination of green draw and blue Tamiyo. I think it's really, really strong. We also have Gotha in there because we can use him, and if you can use the green Gotha, you probably should be using the green Gotha. And uh, we do have Esther Rosa sub just for my boy Tamiyo to stop any kind of shenanigans. Let's see how it does. Alright, what do we get in the first game? It's Gluita. Mm, that's, a, that's a good matchup, I would say. It's pretty damn nice. Oh, especially when we get a turn one play like this. Oh, that is good. That is good. Uh, that's buff and debuffs. All right, so no rank ups, no shields, no stuns, no gauge removals. That is, uh, yeah. Turn one is probably like the biggest spit in the face you could do to someone. Because what do they do now, bro? They can't do anything. They they can't do anything. They can use their Liz attacks. If they if they want, they can use the Escanor attacks, but without rank ups, Escanor's attacks aren't exactly the uh, uh, you know the greatest uh, things in the world. I think we just get draw ultimate here, man. I think we just get draw ultimate. I kind of hope to go. I'm actually scared of attacking Liz just in case we somehow magically kill her. Uh, we'll slam Escanor. Yeah, man. We probably would have killed Liz if we attacked her with that. And then, of course, uh, draw passive does disable the ultimate. <laughs> very good, very good. I think, uh, what? Escanor didn't live steal much, did he? Alright, draw ultimate. Draw AoE just for the sake of it, and then we single target Escanor. This actually should be enough for a kill, because uh, green draw ultimate is, of course, very strong. I'll uh, just draw ultimate in general, and yep, that will be a GG's. I guess I could have just ranked up Tom Yell. Uh, but yeah, as expected, man. If I can, if you can go first with this team, then uh, you are going to cause 99% of people out there uh, some very, very serious problems. Lost Vein is the last one left. I mean, eh, Lost Vein, eh, does he do anything? I don't think he does much. Hold up. Nope, he, he just doesn't do anything. I just I forgot because I draw. <laughs> Joel literally says, screw you, Lost Vein. Hey, that's funny, man. That is actually funny. Well, Tommy will talk because I have nothing else to do. And then we slam him with this level 3 Giga Pick. Ooh, he almost killed Lost Vein, bro. In one hit, type disadvantage, no crit. The no crit was actually really unfortunate, but that was really, really good. And obviously, to finish him off, we can just level 3 him with uh, uh, Tommy L. AKA three pack. That's a, that's a terrible joke, isn't it? Three pack Kek W. Uh, we'll definitely we'll definitely get the kill here for some nice damage. 49k. Let's move on. All right. I forgot my CC food. Unfortunately, uh, my opponent is a assault Meliodas opponent. Hmm. <clears throat> what do I do here? I think this is a good play if I do this. Gauge removal. I know we're gonna give him two stacks, but two stacks isn't the worst thing in the world. It's not it's not too bad, you know. Three stacks is very bad, but anything more than two stacks, that is, you know, you you don't wanna be in that scenario. Um He's going to rush Melascular Ultimate. That's very good, actually, because now I'm actually going to rush Tamiyo Ultimate. And uh, since there's nothing you can do about it, I think we are good to go. Wait, no, I have draw. I have green draw. His Assault Meliodas can't even get Ultimate Kek, W. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, okay. All right, let me get started on that Tamiyo Ultimate. Uh, remember, immune to debuffs, so... Uh, you know, he's not going to be able to slam him. Oh, okay, that's GG's. That is that is definitely GG for this game. Um, nah, it's, yeah, I don't see what more he could do. If he rushes ultimate, he's going to get blocked for two turns by Droll. Uh, is, yeah, what does he, what does he, what does he do? What does my opponent do? Although it would be amazing to have two level 3 gauge removals, I think I'm just going to merge it into one. He almost gets Goth out of there. Please let Goth live. I need that final rank up. Goes for the Petrify on Tommy. Yo, he's immune to debuffs. 
That's not how it works, pal. Also, did I mention I forgot my CC food? I think I did mention it, but I'll just uh, I'm just gonna mention it once again. I did forget my CC food. <laughs> uh, we'll just merge this. Gotha is probably dead next turn. Because uh, Gotha has no avenue to lifesteal, so, you know. But we do get draw follow-up, so we can lock ultimate with draw. Yeah, uh, we win next turn. I seal his debuffs. I mean, there's, there's not really any debuffs he can use anyway, but yeah, he yeah, there's nothing he can do against his team. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Goth is still alive, Kek W. Um, am I really scared of Molascular Ultimate? I am not. Seal the debuffs, get draw ultimate. Yeah, I'm not. And plus, we have the Tomio level 3 uh, stance, so it's like, you know. Do your worst. One stack on Assault Meliodas. It's not gonna, it's not gonna cut it, I don't think. It's not gonna cut it. This team is super toxic. This team is super toxic. Because, um... If you can't, like, wreck uh, Tommy O very, very quickly, you kind of have to rely on ultimates to get him out of there. But with Droll, you can't get ultimates straight away that way against green Droll. So it's like, you know, what does my opponent really do? Um, I think we do this because Tommy O ultimate will do more damage than Droll's. Oh, no, wait. Wait, 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 wait. This is very bad. No, actually, it's fine. If we can trigger... I'm at... No, 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 no. I should have used Draw's one first. I was going to say, if we can trigger Melascula's Revive... Oh, my God, that's very bad. That is very bad. I should have used Draw's ultimate first. Alright, we did uh, trigger it on draw, which is really good. Come on, man. How did I how did I screw that up so bad? How did I screw that up so bad? No, bro. No. He got so lucky. He petrifies this to Rosa for whatever reason. I don't know why. Oh, wait. He doesn't have... Of course he does. Of course he does. Oh, I can't believe I threw that game, man. I threw that game because uh, I misplayed the order of my ultimates. Wow, man. And obviously he had a draw taunt at the perfect time. I'm very upset. I just threw that game, dude. That, that game was mine to win and I messed it up. Unfortunate, we made mistakes. Uh, let's move on. I'm very sorry about that. All right, next game, we get a bonk squad. All right. I'm very angry about last game, man. I can't believe I misplayed that, dude. Very upset at the misplays. This guy has dodge food, I'm sure of it. And if he doesn't have dodge food, then I don't know. But we are going to seal his uh, buffs and debuffs, because why not? Turn 1, if you do not allow your opponent to make any kind of good play, then... Oh, okay. He... Okay. <laughs> didn't He didn't have dodge food. Um, it's going to be very good. So once again, left in a scenario where all he has is the Liz card and the... Ooh. That is spicy. That is very spicy. You're going to throw those Eskinol cards as my phone pings off. Who is messaging me? It is... Oh, don't worry who it is. <laughs> You'll just forfeit. Uh, feels bad, man. Feels bad. But against the glue eaters, we just have a very good matchup. Let's move on. Next game. It's going to be Assault Meliodas. With uh, Blue Derriere. Okay. Oh, I know this guy. This guy's one of my channel members. Kek W. Alright. No, are you fucking... Oh, this game, bro. 
All right, he has dodge feed, right? Dodge feed, dodge feed. Yeah, he has dodge feed. Okay, okay, okay. All right. That, that, that just. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, that misplay actually saved me, dude. Because if I if I blew him with this level three, and he had dodge food, oh, the salt would have been immense. <laughs> the salt would have been immense, bro. Uh, all right. Thank God for that. He's gonna be able to get. No, he uh, he's not gonna get anyone's ultimate. Better use those uh, buffs while you can, because I'm about to seal them, baby. Alright. He's going to waste an Assault Meliodas card. Sure thing. Attacks Tarmiel. Sure thing. Um, I think I can get go. Yeah, I get Gotha Ultimate safely here. Not much he can do. Slam him with that level 3. Now, no more buffs. No more taunts, no more whatever, whatever. Um. Hmm. What's the move here? What is the move? He's gonna rupture. Hmm. He's gonna do that for whatever reason. Okay. Now he does have Assault Meliodas Ultimate. I'm gonna I'm gonna take that off. He's got a bronze and a rank uh, two, so he's not gonna merge back. We get Tarmiel Ultimate here. Now as long as he doesn't manage to kill my Gotha, which he shouldn't be able to, I don't think. How many passive stacks? Two passive stacks. Against Tarmio Taunt? I don't think he can. I don't think he can. <laughs> His buffs and debuffs are still sealed. Oh, that is pain, dude. That is pain. I just realized he still can't use a taunt. That is uh, that is a feels bad. Alright, we should definitely be able to kill Assault Meliodas this time. No more bad misplays from us. We do have the level 3 Giga Pick. Withdrawal. So Assault Meliodas will certainly die. Yeah. Uh, I'm still hurt about that about last game. No, I'm going to keep it real. Uh, I'm actually going to draw Giga Pick now. Then go for ultimate. Then Tamiyo ultimate. There, this should be a full wipe. Oof. Feels bad, man. <laughs> yeah, this is one of my channel members, bro. I'm sorry. I'll message you. <laughs> I'll message you in my Discord uh, after this. <laughs> Feels bad. Uh, yeah, this combo is dirty, bro. Dirty. Yeah. There we go. GG's. Very good game, even against the uh, Soul Meliodas, in which I do not misplay this time. Fantastic. Next game. We get a. Uh, Tommy O. Liz. <laughs> Blue Gotha, you what, mate? <laughs> oh, what, 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 what? Hold up, hold up. Blue Gotha is not Pug Champ. I'm going to apply the gauge removal just to make sure, and then I'm going to seal his uh, buffs and debuffs. Blue Gotha, that is weird champ. Uh, I think he watched, uh, someone did like a, mo a mono blue video. I think it was Nagy. probably watched that video and wanted to try it out. That's funny. I have Droll. I get this Droll ultimate, which I will get this Droll ultimate, unless he reduces my gauge now. I think we're good. I think we are good. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why I found that funny. It was just kind of funny. Um, let's merge this. And uh, let's apply a gauge removal. Or, uh, yeah, let's apply a gauge removal. Remember, my Tamiyo has the Esterosa protection, which I am very grateful for. It's actually been very clutch. So, oh my god, I misplayed. I didn't get draw ultimate. Once again, why am I misplaying so bad today, man? Good thing is, I don't have any more debuffs left in my hand. So even if he, <laughs> even if he seals me with, um, uh, you know, what's his face? Blue Gother, it doesn't really affect me much. Now, 
buff and debuff disable. No, uh, it's actually just debuff disable. Okay. Um. I'm gonna keep that uh, these two at level one just in case I need them. I'm very certain he probably has blue gil thunder subs, so he's gonna be very tanky. Let's see what he does here though. He's got one gauge removal with Tommy. Oh, does he have a second one? Let's find out. Let's find out. But obviously, what he's running here is like very off meta. I, you know, it's not a meta team. Reduces Gotha's gauge. But like... He... You know, I'll just reduce his gauge uh, right now, just to kind of get it out of the way. Wow, we barely broke shield. Holy crap. Merge is level 3? What is that? I need to start using these draw cards, man. It's getting, it's actually getting really bad. There is no way in hell he just merged the level 3 taunt, right? There is no way to top deck level 3 taunt. Surely not, right? Wow. Oh no, it's gauge removal, okay. Because uh, Tom Yo does basically the same thing for like, uh, you know, the animation of his card. It's basically the same thing. Uh, he is going to stun draw, which is fine. Uh, I am going to... Bro, I, 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 don't, I don't even care, dude. Uh, just get these out of my hand. Just get these out of my hand. Okay. Okay. Could have been a little better, but that's, that's perfectly fine. Liz ultimate, but we don't really care about Liz ultimate because it's not going to really affect me. He has to wait two turns. Mm. Man, this game be taking a while, dude. <laughs> this game do be taking a while, man. Um. Alright, you cheeky little... Slam. That's so unfortunate that I'm going to miss out on all that damage. And then gauge removal. That is so unfortunate all the damage I've just missed out on because of that shield. Don't merge. He merged the Gotha card? Oh, feels bad. Feels bad. Come on, dude. Like, uh, this deep into the game, surely your hand looks like trash. Like, surely his hand looks like absolute trash. Like, there's no... Like, I refuse to believe. He's going to reduce my Tommy L gauge. He's going to... Oh, 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 okay. Okay, buddy. <laughs> uh... Uh, do I use this? Yes, I have to use it because he's got go for ultimate. Man, this guy has actually controlled me very well, man. Uh, but we do ignore defense, right? So if he does have blue gill sub, uh, we are going to ignore that and still do a lot of damage to him. That's really irritating, man. It's actually a really solid team, but I feel like it's just... We've been... Like, he's held me up at the wrong choke points for me, man. If you get what I mean. Now, there's been uh, turns where I'm literally about to do a very good play, and then it's like, you know, he reduces gauge, or he has shield up, or he, you know, seals my debuffs. So this is actually really, really interesting for me. Uh, his blue Gotha does do some good damage. I'm gonna stun my Tommy yo. Which means I lose my... Oh, man. I don't want to be that guy, but this guy got so lucky at every choke point where he managed to hold me down. Every single choke point, like every single one. Uh, seal buff and debuff, but it's too late. Do you know how long I've been waiting to use this debuff? And it's like, now it doesn't even matter because all he has is Tommy L gauge removals. Feels bad, bro. Feels bad. Feels bad. 
you got a 13.7k defense Tom, yo, we are getting wiped. We are getting wiped. And obviously, at the perfect time when he has stun, I don't have a Tommy O um, taunt, so... <laughs> uh, obviously, GG's to my opponent. GG's. GG's. That was so not Oh, come on. All right, chill. Calm down. He's spamming me. Okay, fair enough. Wow, man. I can't believe I lost that game. I don't even think it was, it wasn't even misplaced from me, it was just the fact that he had very good RNG at the right time to counter what I was doing, so I'm not triggered about that, that's fine. Unlike the Assault Mediotis game where I lost, that was really triggering because that was just my fault, but against that opponent, it's like, what can I, you know, every time I had a play, he'd shut it down and then vice versa, and it's like, we controlled his ultimate for so long, but it just wasn't enough. Either way, I thought the team worked very, very well. Apart from like the niche off meta stuff that we just saw like that uh, mono blue team which I feel like if things went just a little bit differently we could have won but it is what it is. Uh, we accept uh, defeat graciously. That'll be it guys. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did do smash that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. Turn on that notification bell. I'll catch you later on.